What is going on guys? It's your boy here, Lewis. Back at it again with another video. This video is gonna be something different. You feel me? Not so different, but something different. You know what I mean? The only reason why I have my shirt off, why I don't have any clothing on, is because today we're gonna be talking about Who does not have tattoos nowadays? Tattoos. They don't necessarily have to be, you feel, meaningful. Some other people get them because it relates something to them. You feel me? Let's get started. I don't really want to talk a lot. I just want to get started because I haven't really vlogged in a while. So I just want to get straight to the point. You know what I mean? Um, but okay. First tattoo. You guys keep track of it, all right? I, I don't really know how many I have. This one, my chest piece, which is the most obvious one, it says Andrealis Guzman. That's one of my little sister's names. And this is my, my second last name. Um, This Roman numeral right here is actually two dates. One of them is for my little, one, well, my youngest sister, and the other one for my older sister. I have two siblings. Um. Now, my neck, ah, my neck tattoo. <laughs> um, nah, it's chilling to be honest. Most people ask me if it hurt. Um, to be honest, I don't really remember if it did hurt. I'm pretty sure it did, but I don't think about the pain to be honest. When I go in there, I don't think about the pain. I just go in, let's get it over with. You feel me? That's about it. Um, what does it mean? It doesn't really have any meanings. I was originally going to get the diamond. I, I got a little hair on my tongue. Originally, I was going to get a diamond, which is this one, with wings. But then when I got the, the diamond, the guy was like, oh, come back for the next session. And we're going to um, finish it off, right? So whatever, I left with just the diamond. So I looked hella stupid for like a month or two. And then I went back and I was like, yo, I don't really want wings. Like, everybody gets... The diamond with wings, you feel me? Or like an owl with wings and shit. I didn't want to be the... I didn't want to be a basic, you know what I mean? So, I got the diamond and then I looked up some roses and shit. And I got got the roses. Oh, you hurt. Hey, to be honest, what hurt the most was this right here. This. And, uh... Yeah, that's about it. Like, just this part right here. Because it's like right there on the bone. My Adam's apple didn't really hurt. It felt weird, that's about it. Next off, my lion right there, boy. What does a lion mean? <clears throat> As you guys know, lions represent strength. And, uh, what does it mean? Strength and protection, some shit like that. Well, the, why, the reason why I got the lion is because it kind of represents me, my personality, you feel me? Like, I really like, I care for my family, you feel me? I care for my family, for my loved ones, just how the lions do. They protect their family and shit. And with other people, with random people, they're really like, how do you say, um, not secure around them, you feel me? So they're always alert for anything. Um, Next off, I got this eye right here. As you guys can see, it's an eye. Why did I get an eye? Because I always, I don't know, for some reason, like, I'm pretty sure everybody feels this way, but I always feel something. Like, if somebody's behind me or somebody's, like, gonna do something to me, I always feel it before it happens. You feel me? So that's why I got the eye behind my tricep. Um, This cross, God is always with me, you feel me? So... I got the cross. Um, the owl, it represents luck. If you don't know about owls, owls represent luck. You feel me? Like, good luck. Um, that's why I got it. This, I don't really want to get into that right now. The wing. <laughs> the wing, the wing, the wing, the wing, the wing. Um, I don't really want to talk about that. It's really personal. Mm, let me see the dabber bro i've been backstabbed so many times this means this represents like 
people that have backstab me and shit. You feel me? Like fake people. Um, it reminds me of like fake people, dog. Like it's a lot of fake people in this world. You just gotta watch who you surround yourself with. I got this was my first tattoo. <sighs> ah, that was my first tattoo, Rosa. That's my grandma's name when she passed away a couple years back. Um, me and my cousins got the same tattoos with the same guy. Um, that was actually my first tattoo ever. Let me see, um, this, this little cancer buddy right there, it represents fuck cancer. Why? Because I have family members that beat cancer, so what does that mean, you feel me? Fuck cancer. This rose is right here, this rose. It says, I will fear no evil for you are with me. I'm really like religious, like my family is really religious, at least like my mom and stuff. And I used to go to church and stuff. Yeah. And that reminds me that God, like no matter what you go through, God is always there behind you, you feel me? Behind you or in front of you, like nothing bad is going to happen to you. Like God is not going to let anything happen to you that you can't handle. You feel me? That's exactly what that tattoo means. Um, this other one right here says Aleda. That's my mom's name. This right here means family. The little Chinese letter, Japanese, what the fuck you call it? Um, yeah. Oh, I almost forgot what my back tattoo. I don't know if you guys can see it. You guys can see it. Oh, my back tattoo. Um, and the bird. So what do they mean? The bird represents freedom. And this world, as prohibited you might feel, you're free. You could do whatever you want. You wake up every morning, for those who have jobs or not. You wake up every morning, you go to work, and after that, bro, you do whatever you want. You feel me? Like, you're free. Like, Nothing could stop you from doing whatever you want. Basically, that's what, what, what that means. Um, the back tattoo doesn't really mean anything. I'm actually going to finish it. I'm going to go back and finish it. I want to I wanna have Medusa's face. Right? And that is going to be like the, the top. Like that is going to go down like this on her, on her forehead. I don't know if you guys can see that. So, that's basically... Oh my God, I almost forgot my fingers, boy. And my hands. Well, first of all, family first. There you go, family first. I'm a really like, I love my family. Like, it don't matter what happens, I will always love my family. I'm a, I stand by that. Forgiven. People usually ask me, oh, what do your hands, your finger tattoos mean? It means forgiven. Why did I get forgiven? It doesn't matter what you do. In this world, it could be anything. You can do whatever you want in this world. And that's a sin. You feel me? And if you really, like, repent yourself. Like, if you really, like, apologize to God deep down with your heart and your soul, God is always going to forgive you. No, it doesn't matter what you do. No matter what, He's always going to forgive you. You feel me? So, that's what forgiving means. And then you have power, money, goddess, pentagram, purification, blessing, um, spirituality, and wealth. That's what those symbol mean. So yeah, I don't know how many tattoos I have in total. I have like around 30 something tattoos. Um, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I opened up a little bit more of me. And if you like this video, make sure you hit that like button. That subscribe button and hit that bell button so you guys are the first ones to see every single video i post i promise you i'm gonna be posting videos more often all right guys i love you guys so much thank you guys for the positivity you guys be sharing with me on instagram everywhere i love you guys um let's keep going peace